This is Jordan Tower with JT News. Make sure you smash that like button, smash that subscribe button. Okay, we got Meek Mill and we got Charleston White. So Charleston White has been going off on Meek Mill the past couple of months, especially when he said free YSL, um, which is kind of weird. Yeah, I mean, I understand he wants his friend to be free, but when there's murder charges and everything, it's just like yeah, Drake's been doing the same thing. He hasn't been getting on Drake, only Meek Mill. Uh, but Meek Mill and him ran into each other in Detroit. We already talked about this last night. They circled Charleston White, but nothing happened. But I haven't seen Charleston White. I'm not sure how true this is. Like, if someone started this rumor or not, because uh, I haven't seen Charleston White talk about it. And usually he gets right on the internet and talks about it, especially after the Soldier Boy thing. Um, I guess Meek and them gave him a pass, but like, of course, Meek would doesn't want to get in trouble either. Is Meek traveling with 50 people? Is he on tour? I, mean, I don't know. That's crazy. Um, then we got... Let's see. Ice Spice. She's making her round. She was flown out by Drake in Canada. Who knows what happened there? Okay. But, you know, she has that new track out uh, that I was feeling you. But now little TJ, who just got shot up seven times in Jersey, he's recovering. Well, he's taking her down now. She's the new the new industry girl that's getting passed around. It's so like these girls get like there's certain girls that make their rounds in the industry and are with the same guys, and it's like they get recycled. It's very gross, not just for the girl, but for the guys too. Like you guys are recycling the same women. The girls are recycling the same guys. It's just a weird cycle that's going on. It's gross. Um. Then we got A.B. with his dance. You know, he's done with football, doing his dance, and even 50 Cent's doing the dance with A.B. Uh, that's, that's pretty funny. It's a very simple dance. You just point your fingers one side to the other. Then we got Perkio looking scared, okay? Somebody uh, tried to take a picture of him in the mall. He, he like, posed and really scared for the picture, and the guy was like, you know, I just want to get a video, man. He thought it was a little dark. He thought it was Little Dirk. I mean, this guy's still walking around trying to be the fake Little Dirk. He should really just be himself at this point. It was fun for a minute. You know, he's the fake Little Dirk. You got the fake Drake out here. You got the fake Travis Scott. You got all these fake guys, okay? But uh, I'm surprised nobody did the fake Takashi because they didn't want to get taken out. Let's be honest. If There would have been a fake Takashi, but nobody wants to do that because he's a, he's a moving target. Uh, little Dirk is, I wouldn't want to be a fake Little Dirk either. He's got too many ops, but Perkios, that's probably why he's so scared everywhere he goes. Ops are probably trying to take him out too, just to, just to send a message. But, uh, he was looking mighty scared in the mall. Little Baby gives 250k to James Harden for his birthday. Why? James Harden makes 500k a game. Why not give that, like, Little Baby does give back, like, for school drives and everything. But let's not forget that that stuff, you do have to give back. I love that he gives back. But you have to give back also because if you don't give, if you don't put, give money back or just, like, you might as well just give it out because otherwise it's going to go to taxes. You have to... You can write a lot of that off as a business expense. That's still promoting your brand. Uh, you can write a lot of that stuff off. Um, and it's better to give it away than to give it to the government, right? So they you know, they do these giveaways. And it's philanthropy. You know, you, you, A lot of people benefit from that, from that as well. There's a great um, aspect to it. That's why they let you write off some of it too, I guess. You know, But it's like... Um, you know, giving that much money, just giving it away cash to, to uh, James Harden, who already has millions upon millions of dollars and doesn't need the money, it would be, uh, wouldn't it be better to give it to somebody, one of his friends or something, start a business? I don't know. Just It's very weird, and it's very, uh, it's like a bromance is going on. You know, James Harden got his bromance going on with Little Baby and, and Meek Mill. It's very, very spooky, I gotta say. Um, we'll get into some other stuff in a minute. I, I got some more stories. Uh, we'll save them for the next in the next hour. This is Jordan Tower with JT News. Appreciate you guys so much. Peace, and I hope you guys are having a great Saturday.